there are angels among us when I didn't believe in that anymore. It's a family she never knew she had. I'm never going to be able to repay them. The past five days have been agonizing for Carrie Holton. Her son, 17-year-old Jevin Lemke, was swept under by a rip current Sunday. Since then, there's been an outpouring of support from people on the Gulf Coast. There are no words. This has been monumental. They have given me hope and humanity again. Holton, who's been in Wisconsin, is finally able to come down tomorrow. Last night, we told you about Nikki McClure, the woman planning to take her in. She, she is truly truly amazing. I, she is literally a sister to me. She's my guardian angel and I don't even know this woman. She's also organized search efforts on Dauphin Island. It starts tomorrow at 2 p.m. at the water tower, but that didn't stop people from getting ahead of the game. It's, it's difficult to express how much it affects everybody here. Even though the family is not from here, um, we think about them. We want them to have peace and closure. Rich Brewer walked six miles searching and will be back out tomorrow at first light with some of his boating buddies. There's so many reasons. I'm a father, first of all, and my heart breaks for these people. Um, also, I know the beach really well, and the island is a close-knit community. Holton says she can't thank this community enough. For many reasons, she's eager to get here tomorrow, one being to find Jevin, another to meet the woman who started this all from a Facebook post. I love her. I love her and I am excited to meet her. I'm excited to meet everybody else that will be out there tomorrow. But Nikki is, I can't wait to hold her in my arms. Truly. I'm Carrie Halton.